Prince Harry has broken his silence on Lady Susan Hussey weeks after the Queen's former lady-in-waiting brought a race row to Buckingham Palace. Lady Susan Hussey, 83, who is also Prince William's godmother, quit her post after she was accused of making racist remarks at a reception held by Queen Consort Camilla. She resigned as an honorary member of the royal household and apologized to charity boss Angoni Fulani after she repeatedly asked where she really came from. During his interview with ITV's Tom Bradley, the Duke of Sussex said he and wife Meghan Markle think Lady Susan is great. The 38-year-old said, I'm very happy for Ngozi Fulani to be invited into the palace to sit down with Lady Susan Hussey um, and to reconcile, because Meghan and I love Susan Hussey. She thinks she's great. And I also know that what she meant, she never meant any harm at all. But the response from the British press, and from people online because of the stories they wrote was horrendous. Prince Harry physically recoils after scathing accusation about Queen Consort Camilla was absolutely horrendous, the response. Ms. Fulani, who founded domestic abuse charity Sisters Space, claimed Lady Susan moved her hair to see her name badge and challenged her on where she really came from. The 83-year-old proceeded to ask what part of Africa Ms. Fulani was from. However, Ms. Fulani reiterated she was born in the UK and worked in London. Harry says it did not need to be this way after years trying to get through to family she said she felt interrogated at the reception. A joint statement was issued after the pair held a reconciliatory meeting. The statement said it had been filled with warmth and understanding. Lady Susan also said she would deepen her awareness of the sensitives involved. Dan Wooten slams Prince Harry interview claiming royal chose BFF, reveal Duke set for explosive 60 minutes with Anderson Cooper, inside Harry claims William argued about wedding beard for a week, spotlight, the royal households vowed to focus on inclusion and diversity. In a statement, Buckingham Palace added, at this meeting, Filled with warmth and understanding, Lady Susan offered her sincere apologies for the comments that were made and the distress they caused to Ms. Fulani. Lady Susan has pledged to deepen her awareness of the sensitivities involved and is grateful for the opportunity to learn more about the issues in this area. Ms. Fulani who has unfairly received the most appalling torrent of abuse on social media and elsewhere, has accepted this apology and appreciates that no malice was intended.